Hello everyone, today I will show you how to enable Korean keyboard on Windows 10. So, let's get started. Alright, so let's click the start button or the Windows logo on your PC. Then click settings. Then time and language. Then click region and language on the left pane. Click the plus button to add a language. Here, as you can see, the default language of my PC is English, and there's no added language yet. So here, you can choose what language you want to add. But now, I will show you how to add Korean or Hangul. Click to add. Now, it's added on our language settings. So let's open a software where we can type letters. Uh, you can use Microsoft Office Word or Notepad. You can also work on browsers or social media accounts. So to see where the characters are located, we need to open the on keyboard. To toggle from English to Korean, click the ENG on the right part of the taskbar. Then click Korean. Then click the letter A on the taskbar again to enable the Hangul characters. You can use the on-screen keyboard as reference if you're not yet familiar with the position of the Korean letters. You can type using your on-screen keyboard, but you can also type using the keyboard of your computer, which is the easiest way and the fastest way. To enable the double consonants and double vowel symbols, you have to hold the shift button on your keyboard or click the shift button if you're using the on-screen keyboard.
So that's all. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.